Hello everyone, welcome to the another video of MBBS Info. So in this video, we are going to talk about the admission process of I am such of first Moscow State Medical University. So if you are planning to take admission in this university, do watch this video completely so that you get to know about the complete process and the timeline as well. So let us start with the first process. So to apply in such university, you need to submit your 10th mark sheet, 12th mark sheet, your Aadhaar card or passport. So basically, you can give the entrance exam on basis of Aadhaar card as well as an entry document. And meanwhile, you can apply for the passport and get the passport ready. So apart from this, you only need to submit your photo. After which, we will fill in the application form, and after that, we will apply in the university for you. First step is going to be the application. So after the uh, documents are submitted. We have to submit the document to the university. After which, the university uh, will inform us about the entrance exam. So, the entrance exam of the university uh, for the general medicine, which is the MBBS course, is conducted of only one subject, which is chemistry. Earlier, it used to be conducted for of two subjects, Russian language and chemistry. But after the uh, request of student, the, they only conduct chemistry exam for the international students. So, you have to give the chemistry exam. And uh, there is no fixed date. There are multiple dates of the entrance exam, and uh, which slot you get for the entrance exam will you will get to know only after you apply in the university. So this is the second step, which is the entrance exam. Now, if I tell you about the entrance exam, it will be conducted online in the NCQ format. So you can give the exam from your home, uh, from your laptop or PC. So this exam mainly consists of 20 questions, and you need to score uh, at least 55. Uh, or more out of 100 to get qualifying marks in the chemistry exam so this is only one exam you have to give to get admission in the such university and of course our assistance is going to be there so you don't have to worry about it we will guide you throughout the entrance exam so this was the second step now uh, let's discuss about the third step which is your agreement so after your entrance exam the results are usually out within one to two working days after which uh, we have to apply for the agreement and it usually takes around 3 to 5 working days to get the agreement so agreement basically uh, mention all the details regarding the course regarding the fees regarding the university and regarding you as well so after getting the agreement you have to pay the fees of the university you can pay the fees of the university at semester wise or you can also pay yearly after the payment of the university fees uh, your academic uh, portal will be created on the official uh, university education portal and then uh, we have to apply for the invitation letter so we have to uh, get some documents signed for the invitation letter we will send them to you and uh, we will need your passport at the time of applying for invitation letter passport is mandatory at that time so you need to submit your front and back page of the passport after this we will apply for the invitation letter and uh, invitation letter of society is electronic invitation which takes at least 30 days So uh, this is the next step, invitation letter, and like I said, it takes 30 days to get the invitation letter from the university. After getting the electronic invitation, we have to apply for the visa. Again, this time we will need your original documents, mainly your original passport at our Delhi office. Apart from the passport, you will also need to get your HIV test done, and you also need to submit your current photo as well. So these two can be submitted digitally also. That is fine. So after you submit all the necessary documents, we complete the documentation from our side and apply for the visa. So visa in case of electronic invitation, it takes around 10 working days, 10 to 12 maximum. So after getting the visa, you will get your passport back and your travel arrangements will be made. Now many students have this question, uh, like there are many students who are from different state. Our office is in Delhi, and many students are from different state. Like how will they uh, send their documents? so you don't have to worry about it there are many courier companies which can uh, like send your passport very safely and in fact if i tell you about it hundreds of students uh, from all over india they take admission through us and they uh, safely send their uh, documents or like original passport as well safely to us and it gets delivered back to them safely so you don't have to worry about it the complete process is very very safe so now you have got the visa you have got your passport back so your travel arrangements will be made so after that we fix a specific date and usually we make a group of students of all the students who have got uh, the visa in a uh, date a uh, time frame so that you can travel with your fellow groupmates or going to the same university in the same course 
and after reaching uh, Russia, we will also be there to assist you for the complete documentation for the complete procedures which needs to be done. After reaching like uh, Russia at the Moscow airport, we will take you from the airport to the city accommodation and uh, let's get you settled over there, uh, get you all the essentials, get you the SIM card and uh, register you at the place where you are staying. Apart from this, uh, you need to, like I tell you in other videos as well regarding the admission process of universities that you need to undergo the police verification and the checkups as well, which is which are mandatory actually. So we will take care of all the procedures. After you come to Russia, uh, you will be also added in the group. Actually, uh, you will note, uh, you will get to know about the group before only uh, when your portal will be created. So after paying the fees, you will know about your group. After reaching Russia, uh, you will be able to attend your classes and we will handle all the procedures on time so that you can only focus on your studies. So this is basically the entire admission process of IM Suchino First Moscow State Medical University and the procedure can take up to uh, like 1.5 to 2 or 2.5 depending on uh, the entrance exam dates. So if you have any doubt regarding the university or regarding the admission process, you can definitely contact us from the mentioned number here and you can apply for the admission in Sachinov University. So thank you for watching this video and have a good day.